In this video, we unbox the Return of the Jedi 40th Anniversary Black Series, Pat Blue. Hello and welcome back my friends, Darth Rock back again. Today we're finally going to get Pat Blue out. And yeah, he's going to go well with my Tebow. Sadly I don't have a wicket, I completely missed him. Um, I have him in VC but not in Black Series so I definitely need to get him. Just quickly, let's have a wee look here at the Black Series and the VC. Side by side, look at that. Looking cool, looking cool. Very neat. So yeah, we are going to crack out, not this one. Let's go back on the wall, but this one here. Again, a cool wee image there, Return of the Jedi with the 40th anniversary at the top there. The old Kenner. And he comes with a stick as well. It's weird though, because if you look here, He actually comes with a knife as well, but I don't believe he does unless it's already in there somewhere. Very cool indeed. Spin around the back, not much to see, same old. Black series, and again we've got our line here. I've got him in the box, I've got him in the Amazon special one. Finally got him. I do have Stormtroopers and an original, and I do have an Archive Chewy, so I'm pretty happy with that lot there. But yeah, really need me a wicket to go with the other two Ewoks, so without further ado, let's pop Pat Blue out of the box and add him to the collection. Here he is, out of the box, and we'll give another little... Side by side, there you go. That's the VC. Yeah, he's looking pretty good before I lose that down at the back. Yoink. Let's have a wee look see this stick here. Just again, haven't found a knife. Just the stick here, which is pretty cool. Not too bad at all. But yeah, I really need to keep my hands on a wicker as well. That's that. And here is Pepu. Pretty good, pretty furry. Hands are all weird. This is quite cool. This does come off, I believe, so we'll look at that in just a minute. Yeah, it's just so little. It looks so shiny. She's got that there, but I don't believe that came out. I was trying, and it didn't, so I'm not going to try much more than that. Yeah, that's quite neat, looking cool. Yeah, and that should just pop off his head. Let's get it out of his ears. Like so. And then T bows does. There we go. Off. You ready? Look at that. Oh, that looks weird. <laughs> That's cool. A little bit of detail underneath there as well. That's pretty cool. Obviously, we'll keep that on though, I think. You can get your ear in there. Right, got that back on. So, yeah, articulation is not too much. You do have the waist here and the bend in here as well. And a little bit in the wrists as well, on both sides, and the legs. Though so far, yeah, not too bad. I'll get a stick in his hand. Bit of a short review today, had to. Um, I'll pose him up and stick in his hand with his buddy, and um, we'll come right back. 
here we go all lined up with Tebow over here yeah he looks pretty good real bummer the knife doesn't come out considering the VC one does I find that a bit strange but anyway yeah pretty cool again need me some wicket all right my friends hope you enjoyed that review of Tebow the wicket the Ewok another cool figure go well in the collection next up will be the final of my birthday presents once I push the right button the princess layer which I am looking forward to she's a really good looking layer that one so yeah absolutely awesome hope you enjoyed that everybody um, I will be doing a if I haven't done it already a new tour video because I've pretty much done what I can until I get some more shells. So keep an eye out for that. Subscribe if you're not. Like, comment, share. And until the next one, my friends, give in to the dark side. And may the force be with you all.